My impression from uh, the global uh, climate uh, change event in, in Bonn, uh, COP23, where that, uh, uh, there's a number of people gathering there that are uh, strongly engaged. Uh, also, there are some difficult topics uh, on the table. Uh, first of all, of course, uh, the drawback from uh, the United States uh, from the Paris Agreement was uh, very important. But what I also sensed is that uh, people were very much engaged to see how uh, they themselves, uh, by their own contribution, uh, could uh, fill uh, the gap uh, partly. Uh, still uh, important there, even without the contribution of the U.S., is how can uh, people get access to uh, the funds that are available. And I think that's still an important issue that uh, needs to be clarified. The response of IG Delft and how they can contribute, uh, first of course, is on uh, the combination of, of uh, water and climate. Uh, what I think that uh, IG can do is uh, actually standing on, uh, say, the interaction between the water community and uh, the climate community. And that's both on uh, the academic level, but also on the implementation and education level. So I think by uh, maybe bringing uh, stronger than we are doing at the moment uh, the issue of climate into our courses that uh, can help, but also by uh, looking in uh, invitations where we can bring uh, the climate community into the water arena and vice versa. Looking at uh, different topics, I think IHC Delft is well positioned to, to look uh, at uh, what's happening on the, on the urban side in uh, creating more resilient uh, cities. And there I think the combination uh, between asset management, uh, infrastructure improvement, but also how we deal with uh, sanitation and health uh, under climate change and climate uh, disasters is, uh, I think a very important topic. And of course, uh, financing is, is still an issue. How can you engage uh, financing organizations? How can we learn our students uh, how to write a proposal that will be financed? How can we make sure that uh, maintenance and operation, which is an important issue, is also part of the, the financing deals that are on the table? Uh, of course, there are some nice examples, but I think it's also important that we as IG try to work uh, further on uh, examples how to get the financing sector uh, within, um, say, the present projects that we are running, uh, both on resilient cities, but also on, uh, for example, uh, drought sensitivity, what we can do with water scarcity, which will be another important issue on the table. Yes, important uh, for us with the, the new center on um, excellence of uh, climate adaptation is uh, that we would like to bring from the practice side uh, examples what can be done. And um, I think there are two approaches there. One is a more top-down approach, which uh, concerns the bigger projects. But the second one is also the bottom-up approach, where you engage with uh, local stakeholders and what they can do. Important for both sides is, uh, again, how to get access to uh, financing the different efforts that are there. But also, how can uh, we assure that we align, actually, uh, the different stakes that are on the table? And I think there, uh, conflict management is an important part, uh, which we think can be related to uh, issues like uh, water diplomacy, which is an important issue at uh, IG Delft.